It's fight night! Behold the power of the Celtic Warrior. The following contest is a six-man ladder match. Making his way to the ring, representing the Brawling Brutes from Dublin, Ireland. Weighing in at 267 pounds, the Celtic Warrior, Sheamus! The leader of the Brawling Brutes. I'll tell you, this guy will fight anyone, even his friends. Well, it's a good thing Sheamus doesn't consider you a friend. Still a lot of fights left in the Celtic Warrior, that's for sure. A pint and a fight is a good Sheamus night. My sources say the Celtic Warrior already has a couple cold ones waiting backstage. And from Tampa, Florida, Weighing in at 285 pounds, Big E! A man who possesses freakish power and crazy athleticism. Make no mistake about it, this man truly rocks. He is simply phenomenal. <laughs> you said it, Michael. A phenomenal resume, phenomenal skills, and without a doubt, a phenomenal performer. And from Gainesville, Georgia, weighing in at 218 pounds, the phenomenal AJ. AJ Styles is an athlete who many would argue possesses the best all-around skill set in WWE. Styles has an unmatched drive to win. Undeterred passion, fire, and desire. And we're going to see it on display tonight, courtesy of the Phenomenal One. You know, being known as Phenomenal, that's just the beginning. Well, anytime AJ Styles is in the ring, you have to almost assume that it's going to turn into an instant classic. Yeah, no. A man free of bloodlines who still thinks he's pretty oozy. And from Montreal, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 212 pounds, Sami Zayn. Sami Zayn is a man who's always had the promise, the potential, but he delivered on that promise and that potential when he took Roman Reigns to his absolute limit in a main event battle. Yeah, and now the entire world knows what Sami's always believed, that Sami Zayn is a main event talent who can reach the top of WWE.
<laughs> Just a different feeling in the air when WWE's resident superhero makes his entrance. And from Paducah, Kentucky, weighing in at 190 pounds, Ricochet! You know, it's just shocking the things that Ricochet can do in the ring. Oh, I'll be the first to admit, Ricochet is a downright spectacular talent. Yeah, stuns his opponents with his speed and nimbleness. Highlight-worthy moments always follow his entrance. Here comes six foot eight, 385 pounds of chaos. And from Sheryls Ford, North Carolina, weighing in at 385 pounds, Braun Strowman. Terrifying power with unmatched brutality. And ever since his return, Strowman has been on a path of destruction. Expect the worst. Superhuman confidence from Ricochet as he reaches towards perfection. Bell rings. Money in the bank ladder match action underway. The winner of this match earns a guaranteed contract for the title of their choosing anytime, any place within the next year. That's right. With the money in the bank, you can punch your ticket to the main event of WrestleMania or to a no-holds-barred match in the parking lot of the Performance Center. The sky's the limit. You just have to survive and climb a ladder to get to the briefcase before any of your opponents do first. Yeah, definitely easier said than done. Ladder matches are all about opportunities. You only get a few openings to climb that ladder. So when you have the chance, take it. That's good advice, Corey. You won't get many second chances in a dangerous match like this one. Superhuman confidence from Ricochet as he reaches towards perfection. Oh my God, what a kick. Oof. Getting set up for something in the corner. Oh, he retaliates. Burning hammer. Nice counter for Big E. Choke slam. Shutting that down with the back elbow. Coming back into the ring, back to the action. He catches Braun looking. Scattered it to fire back with a punch straight to the face. He's taking some good hits. Oh my God, look at this. Double suplex. No clue what he hopes to find down there. Ooh, hoo, hoo. Boom, running STO plants him. Nicely done. Oh, the monster on my man. Look at the power. What a toss. Ooh. Sure, he's pumping himself up, but he's also giving his opponent a chance to recover. Oh, man. What an arm drag. And there's the takedown. Short clothesline hits its mark. Clothesline! It'll take things into the ring. Styles not backing down one bit. Looks like he does want some. Absolutely no telling what's underneath the ring tonight. Up and over, all the way to the floor. What's he hoping to find down there? Uh oh, 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 oh. Reversal, what a counter! Sheamus with the virus curse. I don't think Sheamus is done, Byron. Oh. And it's fired by Sheamus. Good grief. What an exploder. As if Sammy couldn't be any more annoying. Backbreaker. Get him up here. Up in the suplex. Oh, no. And that was a precisely measured attack. He's staring his opponent down, getting into that zone. Boom. He's returning fire. Connecting on the DDT. From the top. Catching a drop kick. Oh, look at this. Just cranking the head. That's got to hurt. Oh, man. That'll hurt. DDT. Sermon. Back elbow right on the 
side of the face and another and a third taking this one back to the ring now rapid shots right to the gut climb go for it climb hey he, he can win Sheamus up top He just said, I'd sooner cost myself the briefcase than let someone else win it. And as both men lay there, you have to wonder, where will they find the energy to climb the ladder again? My right, Sheamus goes for a quick ride. He foiled that attempt. Looking for more damage here. Release back suplex. Ouch. Grabbing a hold of the arm. He climbs into the ring. Sure, qualify. Zayn able to adapt. He's setting up the ladder now. Looks like to me he's got it in the right spot, Michael. And they just busted out an impactful maneuver. Oh, man. They do not care who or what they destroy. Yeah, Byron, you are dangerously close to being a collateral of damage in this one. He's in a bad way. He's a sitting duck, Michael. He's got to get away from that ladder. I don't know. I'm looking forward to what might happen. Trying to try to get a quick victory here. Not a bad strategy. Nobody in this building thinks the match can end here. I think so. Go home. He got whipped into that corner. has been an absolutely punishing Money in the Bank match. Now would be the time for everyone to clear out. Easier said than done. They are not concerned about anyone else's well-being. Drop kick! Great athleticism. Squaring off right by our announce tape. AJ. Phenomenal forearm! Did AJ get... Puts him on the table. What does he have in mind? We're about to find out. Woo. Well measured. On oh, the table. On top of the table. Big ending run through the table. Are you kidding me? Ooh. He's doing a whole lot of gesturing, and it could cost him. Just punched him right in the mouth. Relentless. Enough already. Hope you boys put your running shoes on. It might be time to clear out. Ow. Looking wobbly in the corner. Making the climb here, guys. Oh. He's latching on to it. And the crowd is starting to come to their feet. Kick to the stomach. Puts an end to that. And what a maneuver we just saw there. That's one way to use a ladder. Tilt the whole DDT. Double knee backbreaker. Well placed elbow to break up the maneuver. He'll head to the ring. Roll, roll, oh, oh, no. Is this is over. Positioning it in the corner for what? It's a knocking driver. Planning on what to do next. Power slam. No way Sammy recovers from that. Oh, a flying forearm on the mark. We knew we were in for Spines feeling happy. Oh, oh, oh. Big ending. Wow. Stole one from his opponent's artillery. Looks to me like that ladder's positioned perfectly in the center of the... No, don't you dare. Oh, this can't God. happen. This is it. Oh, my God! Oh! The impact. A stunning move, but does that clear the path? We might be about to find out. It's time to start climbing. He's heading back to the ring. I don't know. Climbing the ladder at this point seems to be a bit ambitious. There is never too early to try. Reaching out. Looking to get the win. It seems a bit early to be going for the win, if you ask me. Huh? The following contests 
is scheduled for one fall. And is for the SmackDown Women's Championship! Here comes Alexa Bliss. And Lily, too. Ugh. One of the smallest competitors in the women's division, but she matches underrated power with hard-hitting, high-flying attacks. Lots of titles and main events to back up those claims. Uh, about to learn very quickly as this woman uh, how difficult it is to contain damage control. Difficult? Cole, that might be the understatement of the year. It's practically impossible. She is a woman who is here to take control. You know, with everything Bailey has accomplished, I still wonder why she's just so unpleasant, so hostile all the time. Well, maybe you should just mind your business, Saxton, because you're talking about the first women's Grand Slam champion, the first women's Triple Crown winner. Not only is Bailey physical in the ring, but she can uh, beat you mentally as well. Yeah, Bailey's new attitude was very upsetting for fans who had supported Bailey for years. You include yourself in that group, Saxton, because I find it apropos when Bailey calls you an idiot. She doesn't mean it, does she? Oh, yeah. Introducing the challenger from Columbus, Ohio, Alexa. And her opponent from San Jose, California, she is the SmackDown Women's Champion, Bayley. Anticipation building to see who will leave tonight as SmackDown Women's Champion. And the SmackDown Women's Championship fast becoming one of the most prestigious titles in all of WWE. Multiple historic WrestleMania main events will do that to a championship. Every woman in this industry wants to add their name to this title's short but illustrious heritage. Oh my goodness, dribbling the opponent's head like a basketball. Oh! She catches Bailey with a counter. Arm drag, nicely done. Ah, oh, clubbing blow to the back. Boom, slam! With authority. Bailey's aggression and resourcefulness seems to throw a lot of opponents off their game, but Alexa has changed in her dark side has defeated many opponents before the bell even rings. Bailey's imaginative offense has always been a fundamental asset to her success. I think Bailey's aware of that. Going for a pin for the championship. Power right out and won. Yeah, she probably knew that cover wouldn't do it. Hey. 
Oh, come on, attacking the face. This is uncalled for. Face gouge, oh, God. Just how desperate do you have to be? Why not a fair fight, huh? Being put into knots. And countouts are legal, so hopefully this will be a short trip outside. A quick reversal by Bailey. Bulldog. It's about to end. Bailey to belly. Three. Oh my goodness. Ah, what a smash. That is just insulting. Comes down across the head with the axe handle. Able to get out of the way. What a forearm. Oh, colliding with a barricade. Uh-oh, whip right into the barricade. This match is coming down to the last second. Someone's got to get back to the ring now. Whip back into the ring. Beat the count back in. This one will continue. Momentum's with Bailey now. That killer instinct from Bailey shining through. first. After humble beginnings, this has really grown into a career-defining conflict for these superstars. For years, their names will be spoken together as everyone recalls. Bailey could be thinking about the end. Rose plant. I think the champ's got it. Into the pin attempt. Two. Oh, kicks out, kicks out. Somehow, this title is still up for grabs. Now might be a good time to regroup, rethink your plan. And Story's painted on. Oh, it's gonna happen! Nobody home for that one. Bam! A set up mat slam. On the ropes, referee breaks the count. Bailey avoids the assault. And it's reverse pain for that mistake. Dropping the arm. STO! Knees and a insult to injure. Now a pin for the championship. Strong kick out at two from the champion. She just dug down deep there, but I don't know if she'll be able to do it again. Kick to the gut for the Rose Plant. The champ will stay champ. Two. Kick out. Thought that was the end of her. It was almost just lights out on their championship dreams. Well, let's see if that kick out was a spark or is it the challenger's last gasp. And Bailey can barely believe it. Bailey had her dead to rights. Thought she had the three, but it was a factor of milliseconds. Hot shot stunner. Bailey and Bliss have spared no effort in trying to best one another tonight. <laughs> Bailey left an opening for the counter. Oh, brutal. Oh, come on, attacking the face. This is uncalled for. Ripping and tearing at the face. Dominating shoulder tackle. The champ looking out of sorts. Alexa's attacks looking as impactful as ever, even as this match goes on. And a slap for the exclamation point. Oh my goodness, just strike it at will. Bailey combats out of that. Ah. 
Places her right in the corner. We're going to end this thing now. Oh, a belly to belly from the top. That's got to be it. Two. No, didn't get it. How is the challenger still in this match? <laughs> Bailey setting her up. Spike with a rose plant. Another one bites the dust to the champ. Two count. Tremendous victory. Bailey is still your champion. Here's your winner, and still the SmackDown Women's Champion, Bailey. What a victory for Bailey tonight. Yeah, perhaps exercising some of the demons of the past, silencing critics that said she wasn't as fierce as Alexa Bliss. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the WWE Intercontinental Championship. Get ready for the self-proclaimed problem in WWE. Once consumed with retribution, he has now returned to the light. And Corey, he is now more motivated than ever. Ali may be abrasive, but one of the most highly intelligent competitors in all of WWE. Here comes KO! I think it's fair to say that Kevin Owens doesn't care about anybody but himself. Why should Kevin Owens care about anybody but himself? Nobody's helped KO. Nobody led KO to the promised land. He did it all by himself. Well, if it's deceitful, if it's underhanded, it is in the playbook of Kevin Owens. Introducing the challenger from Chicago, Illinois, weighing in at 182 pounds, Mustafa Ali! And his opponent from Marieville, Quebec, Canada, weighing in at 266 pounds, he is the WWE Intercontinental Champion, Kevin Owens! Oh, 
Tonight continues the tradition of the highly coveted Intercontinental Championship. Its holder is frequently considered by many as the hardest working champion in all of sports entertainment. Plenty of battles waged over the Intercontinental Championship over the years between legends and absolute titans of this business. This match could easily be history in the making. Beautiful senton. Caught him with a big boot. On the mark. Catches the clothesline. Unbelievable standing Spanish fly. Great escape by Owens. <laughs> Kick to the gut. Ooh, brutal forearm. He goes. Oh, right in the mat, face first. That certainly wasn't pretty. Challenger's a little worse for wear now. Oh! Now, I respect Kevin Owens a heck of a lot, but if there's one thing about him that can be exploited, it's the fact that he can absolutely let his emotions get the best of him. His opponent should do everything they can to push his buttons, all while staying cool as a cucumber. They have cucumbers in Quebec, right, Cole? Surely they must. Able to evade. One response after another. Back and forth we go. Super kick! Byron, this is what I wish you would do. Boom! Big time driver. And into the count. Two! He narrowly avoids the count. Not yet. This isn't going to be pretty. Hangman's neck breaker. Oh, gosh. Uh oh. Just a step ahead of Owens. There have been some amazing rivalries throughout history, but this one may be the most heated we've ever seen. Yeah, Byron, they may have taken this to a level many have never seen before. Goodness, a perfect reverse DDT. Paying it right back with a reversal. Caught with a DDT. KO putting his focus on the crowd. Don't waste your time with them, Kevin. They're a lost cause. They'll never be cool. And a well-executed move we just saw there. Oh, Red right in there. Oh, he's looking for the pop-up powerbomb. A championship-level move. Two count. Oh, he gets the shoulder up before three. I don't believe it. How did the challengers survive that? By the skin of their teeth. And don't expect the champ to start going easy on them now. Owens has ended so many men. Lift off. Rough landing. Both competitors showing how well they know one another. Into the neck breaker. Two. Almost inhuman at this point. <laughs> Boom, right in the button. Nice close line. Uh-oh, second rope. Are you kidding me? Wow. Guys, that might have been the best moonsault ever. Two. No, championship match continues. So close, so close. Oh, The champ is down. Title change. I can feel it. And a shoulder is lifted before one. Better hold off on the victory parade. And Owens able to reverse it. Byron, would you listen to this place? Oh, they're going absolutely nuts, Michael. And Ali is feeding off the energy. Look at him go. Ooh. This is amazing. Ali climbs, plans in motion. Oh my! You've got to wonder how much has been taken out of these superstars thus far. And is there anything left? He's able to fend off the attack. Absolutely spiked. DDT. <laughs> Stunner! Looks like the 
the champ is going to retain. Two. And with that, Kevin Owens continues his reign. Here is your winner, and still WWE Intercontinental Champion, Kevin Owens. An entertaining display tonight for Owens. Ali's flight plan just got altered tonight with that loss. No rebound, don't worry. The following contest is scheduled for one fall and is for the World Heavyweight Championship. Cody Rhodes has returned. A man who changed the entire wrestling world and is now ready to prove himself again in the WWE. Multiple tag team and Intercontinental Championship reigns during his first run here in WWE. But now that the prodigal son has returned, Cody Rhodes has reached main event status. He fights every night to make his family, make his father proud. Well, I think they'll be even prouder after his match tonight. Make way for the ring general, Gunther. Six foot five, nearly 300 pounds of pure malice. Look at the pure determination on his face. It's determination and confidence, Cole, because Gunther knows exactly how good he is. Gunther knows he is on another level. It seems like Gunther is rarely in a good mood. I mean, does it hurt to smile? That's not necessarily true. Gunther smiles on the inside when he fillets an opponent's chest with his chops. Gunther is so unflinching, as if nothing phases him. The man's impervious to distraction because he's constantly focused on the task at hand. Yeah, it's like watching a machine. Introducing the challenger from Atlanta, Georgia, weighing in at 220 pounds, the American Nightmare, Cody Rhodes. And his opponent from Vienna, Austria, weighing in at 297 pounds, 
He is the World Heavyweight Champion, Gunter! The energy in this arena is palpable. These competitors know exactly what's on the line. Championship action underway. The champ looks as hungry and prepared here as ever. Yeah, they have absolutely no desire to even entertain the possibility of walking out of here tonight without their title. Oh my God, that's got to hurt. And what do you think Gunther's strongest asset is in this match, Corey? You know why they call Gunther the ring general, Cole? Because he commands the match. Lean on that power and that ruthlessness to keep the match in control and beat the fight out of his opponent. And oh, what a lariat. Goes into the pin. There's two. He's still in the fight, but for how much longer? Cody retaliates. Quick exchange of counters there. Caught with the lariat. Is it enough? Kick out and one for the challenger. He clearly has no intention of staying down. DDT. Planet. Cody has him up. Delivering the vertebraker. breaker. As this rivalry has grown more and more intense, reason has gone right out the window. That happens when a feud is allowed to fester like this one has. Yeah, there's no telling what we might see tonight. There's just so much rage and resentment in the ring. Down to Odin and a double axe handle smash. Beautiful swinging neck breaker. into the corner. Oh, man! Ouch. Double under hook. Power bomb. That power bomb was absolutely worthy of both halves of its name. Backdrop suplex. Hip drop. Cody can withstand much more of this. Gunther beginning to exercise his control over this match, and he may just beat the fight out of his opponent here. Sky high. Splash! Cover! Two! Breaks the count at two. Wow. Big forearm. Hooked up. Driven down. Looking for the victory! Two count kick out! And you gotta think, he's just one final blow away from not kicking out next time. And that prevents Gunther's offense. And responds with a counter of their own. Gunther just a force of nature to contend with. Springboard drop kick. Is it enough? The cover! That's smart. Taking the one to catch your breath. Look what he's got here. Hits him with the counter. Gunther wants to finish this. Power bomb. The champ has this one in hand now. Three, no, a two count. And look at the disbelief on the face of the champion. They both know what's at stake. Neither competitor is going to lose easy here. Hey, Guther definitely thought that would put him down. I can't imagine he's going to take it easy. From the middle rope. Moved out of the way. That could change the whole complexion of this match. Oh, and a reversal. And there's a takedown. Rose gets out of dodge. And an impactful display of offense we just witnessed there. Soaring. Whoa, look out. Big time risk pays off. The daredevil in you comes out when you take risks like that. And he gets set back into the ring. Uh, 
The ring general delivering a powerbomb. Now that is why they're the champ. That's it. The champ stays the champ. Here is your winner, and still world heavyweight champion, Gunter. And that seemed like a pretty easy day at the office right there. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat. Raquel Rodriguez, a massive presence in the women's division. The following contest is a six-woman ladder match. Make your way to the ring from Rio Grande Valley, Texas, Raquel Rodriguez. And NXT Rodriguez won the first ever Women's Dusty Rhodes Tag Team Classic for the first ever NXT Women's Tag Team Champions. Well, Cole, you can bet Raquel has some more firsts in store for the main roster. Look at the spectacular physique of this woman. A back so big, you could drive your car up to it and watch a movie on it. I gotta find out what her workout plan is like. Harder than yours, Saxton, harder than yours. She is quite simply the baddest. Yeah, and the competition is going to find that out in just a moment. And from Venice Beach, California, the baddest woman on the planet, Ronda Rousey. Won the 2022 Women's Royal Rumble, has held the Raw and SmackDown Women's titles. Rousey is a force to be reckoned with. Listen to this place. They're going nuts. We are about to bear witness to the queen. Listen, here is a truly generational talent. There's no doubt about that. And from the Queen City, Charlotte. Hey, if you want to create a legacy in the WWE women's division, then Charlotte Flair is the mountain you have to climb. Yeah, there's no one even close to the amount of accomplishments that Charlotte has. The WWE ring is her unquestioned kingdom. Charlotte will stomp you and then leave an imprint of her boot tattooed on your face. Highly skip. Dewdrop is here and ready for a fight. And from Ayrshire, Scotland, Dewdrop. Well, lately, Dewdrop has developed a serious edge to her. You're right, Byron, and I like it. Dewdrop is doing what she has to do to stop the competition. We are about to see a martial arts masterpiece. Both on the ramp and in the ring. And 
from Chongqing, China, Zia Lee. Zia Lee hails from mysterious origins, and some say she's on a hunt to avenge her father. Some may say that. Others believe Zia has more sinister and ancient roots. No, others equals Corey Graves. The Eradicator has arrived. Ready to pass judgment on the women's division. And representing the Judgment Day from Adelaide, Australia, Rhea Ripley. Physically imposing and a talented athlete. This is a woman who knows how to put her strength to devastating use. Uh, Rhea Ripley is capable of anything inside the ring. You've got to respect that. And the Eradicator about to pass her judgment. Bell rings and we are in the money. Money in the bank, that is. Some have called Money in the Bank the ladder match to end all ladder matches. Now it's definitely the ladder match to punch your ticket to the next level, Cole. Remember, the winner of this match gets a guaranteed contract for the title of their choosing anytime, any place within the next 365 days. And that kind of guarantee is the thing that makes this match so dangerous. Every single one of these superstars is willing to do anything to make sure they'll be the one to grab the briefcase and secure the contract. And that was a successful bit of offense with that maneuver. And she had Zaya's number there. She's pushed into the corner. Ladder matches are unpredictable. We all know that. But if you can pick your spots and prepare for the fact that you're going to endure punishment, you should be able to survive and hopefully come out on top. Nice standing backbreaker and takedown. And that was an efficient form of offense with that move. She anticipated that one. Look out. Ooh. She scores big with the counter. Oh, snapping the leg in. And again. She got launched. What's she waiting for? She's looking more focused on gesturing rather than winning. Gotta find a way to get out of this. Oh, slam! And that toss got some hang time. That offense taking a toll on the apron. Oh, just completely off target there. Zion Lee is looking to deflate her opponent. People really paid to see. There they go. There she goes. Oh, hard impact in the corner. Slips out of the way there. What reflexes? Getting dangerously close to our desk. That's it. I'm out of here. We're in the table. Yeah, I gotta take it to the next level. What is this superstar thinking? We're thinking about the end. Finishing this thing off by any means necessary. That's just hard to watch. And that was an efficient display of offense with that maneuver. Rousey picks the ankle, looking to end this in submission fashion. Now into the submission, hold the ankle lock. Oh, I'm gonna tap out here. But the leg trap shifts the hips and her weight. That allows her to be able to deliver blows to the knee. And that'll break things up. Big opportunity here, guys. This could be it. Turning point. She's looking to unhook it here. I think she's got a chance. 
I don't know about you guys, but this looks like quite a gamble to take at this point in the match. I agree with you, Corey. Saw that one coming. Took advantage. Oh, she continues the fight. High. Oh, this is so dangerous. So dangerous. Oh, what is going to happen here? A couple of yeah. Well scattered by Ripley. Perhaps thinking about what to do next here. Oh, she's trying. Trying to create space. Big time slam. Vicious. And that was offense with a hurtful purpose. This fight is going down right in front of our faces. More up close and personal than I'd like to be. And no count out means she has the whole outside to play with. She needs to stop saying she's going to bring it and actually deliver on the promise. Big form. Goes under the ropes to get back inside. Charlotte a step ahead there. Across the top rope with a neckbreaker. Setting it in place here. Here we go, making that all-important climb up the ladder. I think this is it. She re-enters the ring now. Looking to unhook it here. Here we go. And Cole, a win here would be so incredibly huge. Just a few steps away from victory now. I think it's going to happen. And she's got a good ways to go still. Make no mistake about it. This match could end right here, right now. It could, but I don't think it will. She's sent to the outside. Rousey to the outside. Charlotte just rubbing it in now. What's she waiting for? She's looking more focused on gesturing rather than winning. Could be just seconds. Grabs it, and the ladder match is over. Here is your winner, Dewdrop. What an incredible achievement. Here is our new Money in the Bank match winner. This win is spreading like a wildfire. The electricity in this arena is almost palpable.